<laughs> well, I'm Ranger Cookie, and this is the camcorder test. See how well it records while I walk through the woods. So come along. Let's get ready. Let's see how well the cam, the uh, the, the vest cam works. Does it work good? Does it work like a piece of crap? Huh? I know one thing, that GoPro cam is driving me crazy back here. There you go. I need to put a towel in there so shut its mouth up. <laughs> Mom, I love me. Alright, so what I'm just going to do is just walk through the trail from Hobo to, to, to base and, and see the quality of this camera. Even though I took some videos already, but the quality of it will be on the vest. And the sound quality. See how well the sound and the video quality is for this vest. Let me see my hands. Damn hands. Damn you, boy. Come on along with me. Enjoy the trail while, while you with me. You. Kind of hard to navigate with this big old thing on. Then again, I'm making good progress. Looks like people have been coming through this trail. That's why I came back over here to take a look. See if anybody is. It's really flat. I don't know if that's uh animal making it flat or we got a person coming out here. So let's go check our traps and see if anybody's been coming through the back gate. Remember I told y'all people bought this property over here and since then I kind of closed it off. I shouldn't have any type of footprints or track coming this way. It looks like it's been, it's the same. There you go, it's all blocked off. You can't get back here unless you go through that. I mean you can move it but I try to put some vine through it so no one can't walk through it and I won't walk on that man's property. Well, no one's going through that trail. And it looks like the kids have not been back here since that guy bought that property. That's why I made the trail from my, from that road all the way over here. See, that's a trap. That lets me know somebody come through because most people come through, they don't put the stuff back. Now I know somebody's been back here. Ah, let's take let's, let's take a walk. Come and join me. Alright, right here shows that no one's been walking through here. All this is new plant life growing up. Yeah, the water's high for some reason. See, this was me and Andrew's first campsite. But I found the other one by that tree. He said it was too close to the bayou. So we found the new one. 
this was my trail that I created to get here until I found the other one. It's right there. I'm like, yeah, this is easy. All right. Check for alligators. No, 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 no. I guess it's clear. All right, I'm out of here. You can come with me. Come with me through my trails of hell. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> hurt me. I scare myself sometimes. <laughs> Ow! Right in the eyeball! Damn you, boy! You son of a bitch. Damn, it hurt. Somebody's been digging here. This is why I saw that white tail. Yeah. There was a bunch of deer over here. And all I saw, I saw was a deer ass running that way. I'll never forget those days. Me, Andrew, and Juan. We're camping out here. And I came over here to hobo to clean some fish. And all I saw, I saw was white deer ass. Running away. Oh, you look at this.
There you go. I couldn't get in the damn hole back there. <laughs> Jackass. Ah, look at that. Some old bottles. Some old. My precious. <laughs> what do we do, Ranger Cookie? Don't show suck cam. This would be a good cam. <laughs> Alright, I'm time to go. I'm getting a little hungry. I should cook me a meal out of here. But I want to keep the food I got out of here. It's a rainy day. Most of it's just rice. Rice and grain will last many years out in the... Out in the weeds. Out in the weeds. Out in the bush. There you go. The ranger hat. The ranger machete. It's boring going out here camping by yourself. It's probably one reason why I don't come out here no more. And my gloves. Remember, this is the uh, the uh, camcorder test and see how well it acts. I see at the okay. after moving a little bit, got it out where it usually is. But it's a cool camera for what it is. I paid only $80 for this thing. It's the Air Pro. It's like a gun. Donnie thought I was pointing a gun at him the other day. Are you pointing a gun at me? I ain't doing you nothing, Ranger. There's a camera. Oh, cool. That's a cool camera, so, Ranger. Where'd you get it? <laughs> Walmart. It's not like candy. Ah, now I'm all heavy. Just like to like it. Not too heavy. There you go. Alright. Now, my next request is a filter device with using household items. So I'm going home and make that. I might do that. I might go home and eat real quick. Cook on the clay stove. Come back out here with some tacks. <laughs> Ow! 
What the hell? This is the second time you hit me! Damn you! Boy, getting hit by a tree is not fun! <laughs> Damn, Ranger Kiki you can't walk through the woods. Hell no. <laughs> Feel like I'm a drunk going through these woods sometimes. Okay, that's two back there. Let's see what happens if I turn it around. How's that? How, how's that look? Does it look weird? Hey, at least you can see the bobcat coming after me. And you can yell at me. Hey, bobcat's boy, he's coming to eat you. Run, Ranger, run. But it's too late because I didn't see him and I get killed by it. <laughs> Don't forget the uh, I'll come camp into your area too. How's that camera looking back there? I find out when I get home. <laughs> mama hurt me. Don't mama, don't mama, don't let mama beat you when you get home. Mama's gonna beat you. Don't tell mama you came with me. Don't tell your mama. You might get beaten. Mama, I'm with you with Ranger Cookie. You little bastard, come here. Die, you little bastard, die. You went to whip that crazy guy. How dare you! But Mama, I had fun! We'll all care! Die! Oh, I need to clean my trail out really bad. I think the camera system with the vest is working pretty good. I'm gonna go home and uh, watch the videos and put this online. Just to show you that how the camera system works being on my shoulder like that and I got rid of the harness I could use this camera it records two hours of of recording and it's easy to work I just flip a switch and it turns on and off hold down the button it com completely turns it off just turn it on the switch or cut it on I don't have to hold no button to turn it on I just flip a switch this is made for a bike. Made for a bike. Um, so, you, it's easy to work with. Almost like a Grow Pro, but this is the Air Pro. We're getting to like it, it's easy. It don't require a lot of gear to put it on a stick. Yeah, so all to use the Grow Pro, you have to buy this $50 piece of gear so you can put it on a stick. That's why I hate by some products. Some products this. Oh yeah, you gotta buy all this stuff to make this thing work. I'm like, why you wanna spend $200 more on junk? Like uh, the, the holder to hold it on the bike or something. When I was looking at this, the, the Air Pro, it didn't have a lot of 
you know, a lot of junk to go with it. It just said, here you go, here. But the GrowPro has those suction cups. You know, specially made design for the GrowPro. And it's, so you can't put it with nothing else. You have to buy their product, which I kind of hate. Oh, well, they put it on the camera stand. You got to buy this little thing. That's $10. Oh, you bastards. Only thing to make money. Corporate bastards. <laughs> but I still love them corporate bastards. You got to make money. They have to have greed in their hearts. I want to make millions on this thing. Well, you sure did. All right, let's turn you back over towards me. What happens if I turn you like this? Can you see my teeth? <laughs> I don't think you want to see that part. <laughs> let's turn it this way. How about sideways? There you go. Let's take you for a little walk sideways. See if you like that view. So far, my vest, I have not lost one item. When I was using that other packing thing, the backpack and the fanny pack, I was losing all kinds of stuff. Constantly losing something in the woods. I have to go back and hunt for it. So, the survival vest test is working pretty good there, survival suey. Suey, oh suey. Squeal more, squeal like a pig. That's right, squeal boy. You got a mighty fine mouth there, boy. Squeal like a pig. All right, now let's move you over and down to my hands. This is a video test for the Air Pro for the survival vest. Checking the audio and video quality. And checking the harness operation thing. See how well that works. Damn it. There you go. See the rope, if I drop my camera, it's the only thing is not really attached to the to the survival the vest. But I kind of want to take it out because I don't want to throw it around and break that glass. So try to put it in this little container down here, this little pouch, to protect it somewhat. Because I am rough with my gear. I broke so much, so much of my gear, you know, just throwing it around, being an idiot, you know, or forgetting that something might break in there, or just dropping it on accident. Hey, come back here, or drop it on accident and breaking the items in my bag. So far, I broke a fan. You know that little fan I used? I broke that and I broke my Maya dust maker. Kind of pissed me off, but. <laughs> but I got a new one. I bit the hell out of it. The first one. I lost one. Oh my God, can't find that thing nowhere. I think that I lost it when I was fixing my tire on the side of the road. Coming from Mr. Manland. Damn you, Manland. Made me lose my stuff. How dare you? I have to blame somebody. And this is also a quality test to see about my voice. It's right here. I'm right here, my voice. All right, let's pick you up some so you can see the rest of the trail. I'm almost to the end. So we did a, a quality test for the survival vest.
test out the vest with all the extra gear. I'm enjoying the weight. Uh, a few items that I could take off that I really don't need is the radio, and that weighs a ton. Um, everything else, I think I'm going to keep on it just to have that weight. Remember, I do a lot of. Uh, you know, I do a lot of weights on my body so I can keep my strength up. So when I put up, put my 80 pound bag on, it feel like two pounds. Watch out, Goku. I got you beat. I got you beat, Goku. Damn you, Super Saiyan son of a bitch. If you don't know what that is, just look up Dragon Ball. Damn, Goku, I got you. I got you beat. My suit weighs 100 tons. To your ten tons, you <laughs> bubble won't be super Saiyan. Yeah, there was a guy, he saw me come in the woods, so his smart ass went to go grab a shotgun. And come out here to find out what I'm doing in the woods. I think he got to right there and lost me. <laughs> he lost me quick in my own woods. I got hidden trails and said I can't even find I couldn't find where you went. Got hidden trails. You're not gonna find where I go. Look at all that trash. Oh, 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 all the trash. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have an orgasm so <laughs> let's take a look at all this trash oh, oh. oh I'm drooling I can't help it oh cool look at that I found something I wanted damn you I hit my eyeball because of you look at that folks you know, I was looking for one of those. I was looking for one of those. You know what that is, huh? You put this on top of your car. Look at this. I found one for free. I've seen this before. I just forgot about it. Damn, it got all the twos. Oh, man. I got a freebie. Whoops. Nope, it's from this side. It's for Sears. <laughs> I found a dead body in here. Open up, damn you, boy! See, people throw good stuff away. I could have put this on my car and travel with this baby. I forgot all about this thing. Really, I didn't see this part of the woods. Yeah, I did. I just forgot about it. It's supposed to have a fire pit on this road. A nice. Uh, smoke, uh, thing. Look at this. I can click water in it, but I got it. Yeah, look at that. That was from a gas station. That is a doggy trap. I can make, you know, doggy. Look at all this. Look at all the goodies. Oh, man. Look at all this stuff. Oh, there's the fire pit. That's one of them. It's like a homemade... A homemade distraption. Look at that. Like I said... Oh, look! I hope that's teal. Nope, it's plastic. Damn it! Oh, you wish you had found gold and you found a piece of trash. Damn you, boy! Well, if I ever go swimming, I got a life raft. <laughs> oh, please, dude. <laughs> I saw one bee, and that was it. I'm out of there. <laughs> See that little rope? That rope came in handy, huh? 
Look at that. This is where I was telling you about the barbecue pit. See right there? All right, one put you. One bee scared the hell out of me. I'm flying out of there. <laughs> you get to laugh at me. Damn you people. That bee laying on me, I'm not taking chances. Especially around trash. <laughs> Who hell knew hell? Hell to the new. Yep, I've been here, I just forgot about it. All these treasures. Look, there's a smoker. Probably full of bees. But it's winter, it shouldn't have no bees out here. There you go. Well, we did a test in an emergency situation. <laughs> All right, look at that. I ran so fast the bee didn't even get to sting me. He probably got scared. I'm scared of me. All kinds of treasures. Look at that. There's a trash can over there. I showed Andrew. We we seen me and Andrew seen this. I just I'm not talking about coming. Hey, come look up here. I'm uh, coming out here to get it. <sighs> All kinds of goodies out here. See those bees doing winter? They go hide and in their little fort there. Look at that big old monster bucket. More, oh, more treasures. Oh, oh. You want a sliding door, patty door? Good for a, a good, uh, good protection. See, this is my type of survival. Using trash to survive. And they got tons out here. This is where that, uh... So I know where to turn now to find this thing. Because I, I knew it was here. I just forgot about the damn thing. Some bricks. I don't know if I'm going to carry bricks everywhere. And that barbecue pit. I might come back here and get that. That's what I want. I can put that on top of my car. Look at it, it's the Sports 15 C A R V, whatever. Well, the owners threw a lot of stuff away in their yard, in their, in their property. I bet you used to have all kinds of stuff out here. I mean, some people just litter up their own yard for unknown reasons. Or somebody paid them, look, can we put, put our trash on your property? Alright, right, trash. See, somebody asked me about my motto. What's your motto? What is what's your your main channels about? Using trash to survive. Uh, come back, come back and watch. My motto was taking trash and and making a survival tool. And so when I started my five C's, after all these videos and all these requests were done, I'm going to start my five C videos. This is going to be a long, very long and painful videos. Five C's. I need to go over there one day or go through all that trash and see what's really in there that I can use really good.
I had to create a new strap to this thing just to keep it where I want it. All right. You know, I've been coming out, out here in these woods for about five, five, six months. You know, I passed this one thing up and never noticed it. A deer stand. Never noticed it until like a year, uh, about three months ago. I'm like, that's a deer stand. <laughs> it's been there for a while. All right, I'm going to go ahead and let y'all go. I hope you enjoy the vest test and its camera. This is going to be the video walk and chat test. Let's see how well it worked up here on my shoulder on my vest. All right, see you in the next video. I, like I said, I hope you enjoy my videos. I hope you like my videos. Please leave a comment. It's free to do. And it helps out the channel. All right, I'm Ranger Kuki. And I will say, see you in the next video. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, man, man, wait, 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 you got knives on you. Oh, well. <laughs>